Let's start from two. Don't push too hard. I will let you go. Yes. Hi. Again. Yes. You'll be numb. Yes. Hi. Fly away. Yes. You'll be numb. Yes. Again. Take this. You'll be numb. Hi. Again. Yes. Hi. Again. The best results you could get. Don't push too hard. You'll be numb. Yes, sir. Yeah. Again. Fly away. Hi. Again. Making an incision. Yes, sir. Fly away. You'll be numb. Yes, sir. Fly away. Hi. Again. Fly away. The best results you could get.
nothing's changed. Well, actually, I think it's gotten worse. It is worse. Look at Finno's limbs. Chains and fetters? Exactly. She can't move from here. You'd better save her. Finno, why are you chained up? I'll cut you free. No, no, don't come near me! Shit! It still stinks like hell! I said don't come this way! But how can I set you free without coming close to you? I heard some bozo named Zoi will demolish this tiny world. I know! Then you know I need to sever your chains. Don't worry, I'm fine. I can handle it all by myself. I'd rather not let you come close. Well, it does reek. But shouldn't you be freaking out a little more? We're dealing with your life here, you know. I know, but... Oh well. Anyway, I'll go look for the key. If you have the key, you can set yourself free, right? Yeah. Okay then, wait here. Aldo! Huh? Thank you. Don't mention it.
Bueno! You're too late. Aldo! Since you were so late, I kindly opened the lock. Let Fiddle go! I can't do that because I have to stop her heart from beating right now. What? I'm sorry, but I don't have time. Do you remember the rule of this world? If one person dies, everyone else is remaining time. I will live on. And to do that, I have no choice but to sacrifice some of their lives. So, you must die here and now, Fiddle. <laughs> do it if you really must. But know this. The moment you let loose your arrow, I'll have killed you in the next. You sound so confident. Why don't we test it? No! You'll die, Aldo! Don't worry. Just sit back and watch. Believe that I'm gonna win. No matter what. Okay! She's such a clumsy and stubborn slob. But I still don't want her to die. If you're trying to kill her, I won't go easy on you. Even if you're close in some convoluted way, I'll never let you harm her. I'll deal with any moron that comes to hurt her! I won't let you lay a finger on her, Finalis. She's my... Otto! My servant! Otto... Lay a finger on her, and I'll slice it off for you. All right. I'll show you what the price of arrogance is. Cut! I won't let you! <clears throat> That's not possible. <laughs> I win. Aldo, hey! All right, Finnell. Let's get you out of here. We have to hurry! Hey! You don't have to yank me by the collar! <laughs> the situation is heating up! Ooh! I love chains! Huh? You want to be chained up too? No. I want to make Finno get down on all fours and pull her along while I'm walking a dog! That's what I thought. You're the other type. We should be fine after coming this far. I said a little too much. Forgive me. You know how I get when I'm mad. Oh, no. Hey, don't look so gloomy. I'll unchain you right now. Please don't. What do you mean? You don't have to take the chains off of me. Huh? Well, actually... Maybe I kinda like this kind of stuff. Huh? <laughs> what are you saying? Well, not with just anyone, but with you, it's okay. If you're my master, I want to stay like this. I like to be controlled unconditionally. It makes me feel safe. So, please, let me stay like this for a while. Well, uh... What? Aren't you going to make fun of me, embarrass me, or curse at me? Please, don't ever let go of that chain in your hand. Knowing that you're holding it makes me feel safe. What's wrong? Please call me servant, like you usually do. And stare at me closely with that intense, sexy look. The more you watch me, the more special I feel. I... 
thought I wouldn't mind dying until just now. What are you saying? Because Soma is much stronger and more efficient than I am. And it was harder for me to keep living. <laughs> Death has always been stalking me, so I hardly ever feared it. It was scarier to have to live a life brimming with sorrows and hopelessness. But then when I saw you trying so hard to save my life, it made me think that maybe I do want to live. I started to believe that living wasn't that sad, as long as I was with you. I know you'll pull the chains when I'm going the wrong direction. Of course I will. So... I want you to hold on to my leash tightly. In that sense, I want to be your servant forever. As long as you keep me leashed, I'll continue to live. However tough my life gets, I'll live it along with you. But Fiddle... Please! Alright. If that's what you want, I'll leave your leash on. Do you promise? Yeah, but... I'll never unleash you, even if you beg me. You'll come with me anywhere, even to the depths of hell. Okay, I don't mind. <laughs> I'm so happy. Uh, but anyway, you're a natural-born Ultra M girl. What? Yep, you're a pervert. You feel safe being chained up, right? Uh-huh. Well, it's okay. I don't care if I'm a pervert. Just please remember this. I'm... only perverted when I'm with you. Around other people, I'm just a normal, wholesome girl. A paradigm shift. Awesome. Now we can get out of here! Let's go, Fiddle! But... what about Soma? We don't have any choice. It's better than you both die. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 